This video is one in a series about the quick and easy Stirling engine. You can find the plans in the book, and the book is available everywhere. In this first video, we're going to show you how to create this joint that fits against the side of the can, so it's a nice tight seal. We start with a pipe elbow. This is a PVC pipe elbow. If they don't have these in your market, there are similar things that are available, and there's actually a list of European equivalents on the Sterling Builder website. As you can see, it has a surface that doesn't exactly fit flush against the side of a soda can, and what we need to do is we need to modify that so that it will fit. There's a couple things we can do. If you don't have a heat gun, you can use a piece of coarse sandpaper you wrap that sandpaper around the can and then you can sand this until it takes on the form that you need it to fit against the side of the can. What I'm going to show you right now is how to do it with a heat gun. And the heat gun, here's, here's one that I got from Harbor Freight Tools, it will heat the plastic up enough that it will get soft and start to melt and then when it gets easy to form and shape, I'm just going to press it against the side of the can and hold it there until it cools. So this should just take a minute to get it warmed up. You can see it got warm and soft and now it's pliable and I can just press it against the side of the can and it'll take on the shape of the can and I hold it there until it's cool. Now it's taken on the shape of the can and it'll seal easily against there with just a little bit of glue. In the next video, I'll show you how to make the drive diaphragm out of a balloon.